What we're talking about in this uh, segment is um, the critical mass phenomenon that has happened in Bloomington now twice. Not only here, but it's been happening around the United States and Canada. Critical mass is when people with bicycles get together and they take over the streets. Um, I think the origins were um, more of an environmental distress signal. We need to depend less on cars and more on our uh, muscles, our uh, lungs. The next one that happened was a little less uh, cheerful and a little bit more um, aggressive. Oh no, go away. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> All right, how are you, Chief Sharp? Pretty good. What's good. Up? So uh, you guys are down here for the critical mass, I guess, huh? Yes. Yeah. Um, what is the police's uh, uh, perspective on this? As long as it's a uh, legal and not disrupting traffic, then they're, they're free to ride. And once they get in a position of disrupting traffic, then we'll take the appropriate action. Hey, I just came here for critical mass. I heard this might be illegal. Uh, I don't know anything about that, though. It's the fulfillment of the bicyclist's ultimate fantasy, which is, of course, to run all the cars off the road. <laughs> hey, wow, look. Oh my god, it's you! It's you! You know, this doesn't have to happen um, just in big cities, you know, Metropolis, Megalopolis. It can happen in your own sweet hometown. Wow. And look, people are going. Let's watch the cops freak out. Hail to the almighty dollar, and it doesn't take a white collar scholar to follow this. You know, I think we all know the people with the dough control the whole show. So go, go, you're the cream of the crop. Why should you stop? You rise to the top. Let it trickle down to the rest of the nation. Thank God for the fascist corporation. Anarchy in action. Obstruction of traffic, okay? That's what, what you're going to be traffic? cited for, okay? Is it Down legal to ride a bike in the, in, the, in the road? You see, all we did was cycle on the road and we get pulled over and we get a citation for nothing, just cycling. Yeah. So, you tell me, you tell me the fairness. And one of my friends there, he was uh, because he didn't have ID, he was handcuffed and brought to the station. You call that fair? The only reason I don't have identification is because I'm wearing a particularly tight pair of jeans. I didn't think I. Go ahead, MC. What are you arresting this man for? He is being charged with obstruction of justice, sir. <laughs> So what purpose was served by arresting these folks? Hmm? Partner, step on the sidewalk, please. Thank you. <laughs> Making friends with the press, I see. What'd you think? Um, it was very exciting. Um, however, the number of people decreased, I think, by half because yeah, of the probably. hostilities. Yeah. I got hostile. <laughs> well, I think it was a success just because I mean, it just proves like how hostile people are towards bikers. Yeah. Got them run off now, huh? So for example, there's this big misunderstanding about things like critical mass, um, where critical mass is called anarchy. Um, but in fact, it's just a kind of chaotic event occurring within um, a status system. So, you know, there's nothing very anarchistic about that. For what? You never said I was under arrest, sir. I'm what, telling what, you, you never said I was under arrest. Over. You never said I was under arrest, sir. No. Yes, it is. Sir, sir you no, never said, you never said, you are under arrest, sir. You're under arrest. Now you say I'm under arrest. God damn it! Get off! Get off! What the hell are you doing? Hey! Get off! Get off! Stop! Get off! Get off! Get off! Get off! What the hell did he do? Get off him! Get off him! What the fuck did he do? No, God, you fucking bastard! Is it okay for me to That's it, you fucking taking someone who's just doing his voice, man. Stand up. 
some real friends around here, real friends. God bless America! So the HT ran this article, Bicyclists' Tactics Rile Police. Of course, it could have mo just as easily said, Police's taxic Tactics Rile bicy Bicyclists. But, you know, there's there's a police, a pro-police bias to this newspaper. If you haven't caught that since living in this town, um, you need to go back three squares and, and, uh, and turn in $4 of your play money.